Hi, welcome to this video. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create the notification in your website by using a simple and free plugin called OneSignal. After following this video, you can create your own notification for the users so that user can easily subscribe and just get the notification like this. So let's get started. At first, let me go to my website. So this is the website that you are going to add the subscribe function so that user can get the notification. You can easily create this website using the Astro theme. Let me go to my dashboard. Let me go to plugins, add new. After that, search your one free plugin called one signal. Be sure you do not have spaces between these names. After that, just click on this install button. Now click on activate. I have used this demo website for showing the plugin for you. After installing and activating this plugin, just click on this one signal push. After you click, you'll see these options, which is telling you to create an account on the one signal or login in your one signal account. Let's go to one signal. Just click on sign up and just click on Google. So it is telling me to name the website no name. So I'm going to name this. After that, I'm going to choose web push because I'm going to put the notification for the web. I'm going to just click on next configure platform. After that, choose your WordPress because we are creating the website on the WordPress. And now click on WordPress and choose your site name and it is telling for the site URL let me copy my site URL and you can upload the default icon URL which is show in this part of the notification this is just a demo logo let me click save if your website do not support HTTPS or if you do not have SSL, then you need to check mark this. I'm going to click save. After that, you will get this app ID and API key. Just copy this app ID. Just go to configuration and paste it here. After that, copy this API key and paste it here. Now just click on finish. After that, as you can see, the web push platforms is activated in all the browsers except Safari. We are going to do with Safari too also, so do not worry. Let me click save. Now let me go to my website. Now as you can see, in my website there is one logo, which is telling me to subscribe to notification. When I click this. It is telling me to show the notification with the native browser support. Let me click allow. And now notification is activated on the site. And I got this notification with this icon. And it is telling me thanks for subscribing. Now it can easily send the notification to the browsers except Safari. So let's configure for Apple Safari. Just click on this. After that name your site and copy your URL. Just click next. I'm going to choose WordPress and just copy the Safari ID. Just go to configuration and paste your Safari web ID here. Just click save now. Now, I am not a macOS user, so I can demonstrate you, but from now, it can send the notification to the Safari web browser also. Here are few options too that you can choose. You can prompt a user automatically when some user come to your website. By clicking this, just click save. And now, when a new user comes to your website, then he or she will be prompted with this message 
by telling to subscribe to the notification. They can allow or cancel it. Here are some other options to choose the size to large or medium or small. You can choose the position to bottom left or theme to red or white. You can change the messages from here easily. And here are some other options that you can change and after that just click on save. Now you have configured the one signal. Let's see what happens when the user posts the blog. Let me click on the post. Add new. Let me choose the title. Let me choose the featured image. Let me publish it. Now, as you can see, you got one message telling that one signal push successfully sent a notification to one recipient. Now, as you can see, I got this notification with this icon and its featured image. When I click this, it will redirect me to the blog. In this way, you can use the one single feature to send the notification when the user subscribe when you post the blogs. So let's learn how you can create your own push notification to tell some of the new feature of your website or some of the new offers that may come in your website. Just go to one signal. Just go to dashboard. Here you can see all the information of how many users subscribed and how many users clicked. Let me click on new push. Let me choose the title and message. You can upload the image or you can put the launch URL. If you do not put, then the default will be your site. Here you can see the preview of how it will look on the operating system. Let me click on confirm. Let me click on send message. You can also schedule the message so that the message will come at the time that is set. As you can see, I got this notification by telling the notification that I have put. In this way, you can create the custom notification on your own signal. I hope this video was helpful. If you find this video helpful, then do not forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. And thank you for this video. Stay tuned. Goodbye.